everyone so welcome to this new vlog i am headed to barcelona today and already packed everything dressed and ready for the flight this is my luggage my bag already someone Hi. waiting for me over here say hi to Marlena. you can subscribe uh, there i'm gonna put a subscribe button for you guys and now we're waiting for the other grads to come Checking in. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> the room where I am staying. This is the W Hotel in Barcelona. My luggage. And the view is breathtaking. Oh, Barcelona, you are so beautiful. And here you have like a little glimpse of the industrial harbor, I would say. So pretty. And this is me today wearing this jeans by Mango, the sweater, and the thing over here <laughs> is by zara and i have to say i think the hotel is pretty so babes i changed into something more appropriate for barcelona still wearing this jacket from zara because it can get cold and then this is the top i showed you before it's by zara as well it only has one arm and i think it's nice for this half good half bad weather the pants are by h&m they're so comfy and the bag is by Celine. This is my all-time favorite. This is the first bag I've ever bought myself. And it's really hands down one of my favorite bags because there fits so much in there. I don't know, it's an all-time classic. It never gets old. Like whenever I wear it, people still give me compliments for it. So a really classic bag. You should. If you consider buying one, this one is good. A good investment. And our plan for the day is really having no a plan and no clue at all what we're going to do or see. But I really want to go and see the cathedral, the Sacrita Familia. I don't know if I say it the right, but I'm going to show you because it's stunning and I've never seen it. The last time I was in Barcelona, I haven't seen it. So this time this is a must for me. And what else? Let's have a look because you can see the skyline from here pretty well. Guys, can you see that there is the Sagrada Familia? I think I'm gonna walk there. You can walk here, the beach, and then through the city. And then I would have loved to go up the hill. But I think I have to do this the next time. Up there. This looks so pretty and I think you will have this most stunning view over Barcelona. But yeah, let's see. It's too big, guys. I cannot get it on the screen in one. Do it like this. So pretty. And as my dad, the tour guide, just told us, it's gonna be ready in six years, and then they built this for a hundred years. So we wanted to go inside this amazing building but unfortunately I don't have any tickets left so next time I'm here I'm gonna go in there because my dad said it's really stunning from the inside next time wow I have to go there look at all these birds definitely gonna go there what? These. They're not even scared. There's so many pigeons. Ready? She is the pigeon whisperer. She has all of them there. What? She even has one on her arm. 
So guys, we're on our way to my favorite restaurant in Barcelona. I just said that, I've never been there, but Chaconis is always so delicious. Here we are. Wait. Pizza and pasta time. I'm gonna show you the kitchen because it's an open kitchen and it's so nice. kind of obsessed with nice bathrooms who's like that as well this looks like so old but still so pretty kind of obsessed just as obsessed as I am with my Celine bag since so many years and now I'm gonna have some nice pizza and pasta let's see who shares with me because I always want both and not all of the people want to share the food with me they're like no I take only pasta I'm like we can have it all. We just need to share. So let's. I guess my brother is in for that. You guys, now you know why Chaconis is one of my favorites. Look at this pizza. Sebastian is having. What's that? What is it? <laughs> and my mom, of course, she's with me in the pizza game. And my dad, what is it? Oh. So my loves, I'm ready for the game and because it was so windy in... What's going on with the hair? Because it was so windy today in Barcelona. It was super sunny and the weather was awesome, but it was also kind of cold for me. I am always freezing. I'm wearing this cashmere sweater, a coat and this cute baby bag where nothing really fits in <laughs> except of a lip gloss and lip balm but i've got my um wallet in my jacket so i think i'll be safe but i only have a big bag with me and the last time i went to a game in a foreign country i think it was in milan you cannot bring a big bag into a stadium which of course i can understand but yeah, it was bit of a pity because then you have to lock it in somewhere and you really have to trust the people that your bag won't be gone after that but it was all good but this time i thought let's go for the smallest bag i own <laughs> this is a boy bag by the brand boy which is i think it's cute it adds a little bit of color to my beige outfit so let's go to the game barcelona versus dortmund and of course i am for dortmund <laughs> So guys, the game is over and I am back in the room. I'm gonna take a shower and then pack the rest of my stuff and it's time to go to Hamburg because I'm filming there something for German TV. I have to get up early in the morning, so it's time to take a shower and go to sleep, take my beauty sleep. Unfortunately, the game didn't turn out so good. They lost 3-1, but I mean, it's Barcelona. Barcelona is the best team in the world. For me, they play the most beautiful football, soccer, whatever you want to call it. So, yeah, next time will be better, I guess. So, and if you would like to see different kind of stuff, first of all, thank you for watching this little Barcelona vlog, city tour guide, whatever you want to call it. Um, if you would like to see different kind of stuff or if you like what you see, then please subscribe my channel so I know that you like. Um, and also if you'd like to see different kind of stuff, comment down below and I know what I can show you guys. So, have a good night. See you soon. Mwah.